Welcome to the Minecraft Education Edition Movement Tutorial. You don't have to be an expert in Minecraft to be able to lead a Minecraft lesson in the classroom, and learning how to move and navigate a Minecraft world can be fun and will give you the confidence to play, create and learn. So get your mouse and keyboard ready and let's begin. At the very beginning, just above the hotbar, we are given a text hint to move our mouse around and point our cursor at the gold block. The cursor is also known as crosshairs and is the little cross in the centre of our screen. When we move our mouse, we are looking around. Let's look at each golden block. As I look at each block, they turn back into iron ones. The last one is behind us, so keep moving your mouse and turn all the way around. Brilliant! Turn back and let's head into the park. To move forward, press W on your keyboard. I often have my left hand resting on the keyboard and my middle finger lightly touching the W key. Pressing W will move us forward. As soon as we get to our first obstacle, we're prompted to use the A and D keys to move left or right. Let us use a combination of W, A and D to move through this obstacle course. Excellent! Continuing to the fountain, we're given a hint to use our mouse to turn. You can actually hold down the W key and move continually forward using your mouse to turn and move in the direction that you are looking. Let's have a go. Hold down the W and move your mouse to navigate around these corners. If you get stuck, you can use the S key to move backwards. If you're feeling confident, you can start to combine WASD keys and your mouse to move around to the next stage. Great job! By default, Minecraft's auto jump is on and a one block step can be easily jumped over without you even realising it. But steps and in later tutorials gaps can be jumped up and over by using the spacebar to jump. Have a go now just to test it out. Let's call it a jump for joy. Hey! Woohoo! Ha ha! Now jump over the logs and make your way to the exit. Congratulations, you've completed the lesson. If you want to try it all again, walk on the pressure plate. It's by the sign on the left. Otherwise, why not go for an explore around the town? You can even try holding the control key and W to sprint. Have fun!